Northampton Borough Council recently announced plans to move Greyfriars bus station to the fish market site in the town centre. Plans to rebuild the bus station would have been over 30 million, whereas moving to the site in town cost only 6.5 million. Christy Midgley, creative director of the fish market gallery, is sad yet optimistic about the move. It was never ideal. Um, and although it looked glamorous when we made it look beautiful in the summer, it was, it was problematic. So it's sad, but we support the town being developed as much as anybody. We need to make the town vibrant and lively. And the Grosvenor Centre and the bus station do need a change of some sort. Uh, and so as long as we can fulfil our needs and our requirements, which we think we can do, we're fine with it. Christine expects the move to upset the people of Northampton, so we went to find out what they thought. Um, what are your thoughts on the bus station being moved to where the fish market is? Uh, it's absolutely outrageous, really. I mean, the fish market should be used as a market, as it is. It's a building that's already existed, it's no problem. The market traders could have a choice of moving in there, or in fact both, couldn't they? But the bus station works. I think it's a shame to lose the fish market, to be honest with you. you yeah. know, and I think they should think a bit more about what they're going to do with it. I think it should stay where it is, because when that, when that happens, it will be chaos, because a lot of buildings have got to come down. So I think it should stay where it is. Access into town is probably going to be altered for disabled people. At the moment, they can come in and park over there. I don't know what's going to happen with that. Um, it's not good. They're going to put 11 buses on this place here, which is absolutely stupid. And then they're going to put the rest on the... We're going back 40 years. Many people are sceptical about the council's plans for the bus station. However, the majority think something needs to be done. Ben Taylor, Unique News.